everybody, welcome to LS Mowers. I appreciate y'all watching the channel as always. Today is Friday. Y'all know I do product reviews on Fridays. This is one of the product review dump for this week. And uh, I tell you what, I have got a Top Don um, jump starter that y'all saw a few weeks ago. Man, I love that thing. I, I use it quite a bit. And they have sent me another product to test out here. It's one of their battery analyzers. It's their BT100W. And uh, it's got wire, it's a wireless battery tester for a 12 volt battery. So 12 volt only on this. Uh, some get six, 12, and 24. They do have an app that you can download in App Store and Google Play. So pretty neat that you can see it on your phone. I don't know how much, you know, more of a purpose it would have uh, than just being here testing it out. but. Still, there's an app for everything nowadays, right? So we'll go ahead and test this out real quick. I will link the description to the product below. If it's anything like their jump starter, it's gonna be pretty good. So let's go ahead and get started. So I was looking through the user manual. This thing's got quite a bit of functionality on it. The app is basically just an enhanced version of this. Right here, you can get battery reports and um, like your battery history and whatnot as opposed to just real-time data so if that's something you're into then you know check it out I'm not per personally I'm not gonna download the app just for testing the product this uh, honestly is probably gonna be my dad's Christmas present because he could definitely use one of these so get this all untied here we're gonna strap it to the battery to get the voltage this battery is one year old however it is leaking a little bit of battery acid out of the positive terminal so let's get on here and see what we've got. We might, might test it on the car or the mower or something here in a second too. So now it's loading up. It said 12.63 volts battery test. We'll just do that right now. Uh, this would be a regular flooded battery, lawn and garden. I think that's all the options, is it? Yeah. Cold cranking amps, enter. What have we got? We've got 340, so we'll go down there to 340. 340, let's test. Should test okay. Good battery, so there, I like this a lot. Uh, health 92%, charge 100%. 340 cold cranking amps, it's still got 326, 12.61 volts. 9.2 milliohms of resistance so that's really cool so you've got a cranking test a charging test you can review your data and all that stuff too so what I might do with the uh, cranking test I've got a lawnmower right here that actually won't start because it's got a carb issue we might try it on that all right guys we're gonna try the cranking test now so I've got it on another battery we're going to do the cranking test. We'll see if it will start engine. Let's see. It might RPM started. Press exit if failed. Okay. So obviously the starter failed, but it was showing your cranking voltage of 8.87 volts and it took 3835 milliseconds for it to start. So obviously it did not start, but it'll show you, you know, if it's got enough battery to crank it over and stuff like that. Obviously this mower is not going to start. I've got the garage door open because the uh, next door neighbor's mowing grass, but I bet if I started my car it would say passed and whatnot. Pretty cool test though. And then you've got a charging test, so what you could do there is you start the engine and press energy continue and it'll, you'll figure out how to, it'll test the battery to see if it's charging. So this is more of like a test to see how good your alternator is. So you've got that. Pretty simple. You can review your data. And when you go to the main menu, it actually shows you the amount of voltage that the, uh, the thing has. So let's review our data real quick and then we'll end this video. So it's showing, oh, okay. So here's your, this is the old battery. So that's the original battery. You can go back and see the original battery. Now, if we tested this battery, let's see. Keep hitting the exit button, guys, sorry. We'll test this battery to see. This is a 300 as well. 
or this is a 300, so let me go to that, enter, testing. This one will probably be kind of in the charge state, if I were to guess. Yeah. It's got 224 cold cranking amps, 12.2 volts. So, uh, it needs a little bit. But hey, really good tester, guys. We'll wrap this video up. All right, guys, so there it is. Pretty cool product. You can use it on your mower, vehicle, uh, kind of just to give you a state of the health of the battery uh, to see if the battery is good. You know, decipher if you need it, if you have a parasitic drain or something along those lines, or if the battery's just getting old and run down. So, super nice. Remember, you have the app, it just gives you a little bit more enhanced features and stuff on the app. Uh, instead of just the little information you get on this screen. But super nice. Thank you, Top Don. Another good product from them. Uh, Dad's Christmas present right here. So pretty cool. I think he's going to like it very much. If he likes it as much as my first battery tester that I got uh, to use here in the garage, um, probably going to enjoy it. So thank you all again for watching. Thank you, Top Don, again. If you are a company looking to... Uh, have a product review done on it, you can reach out to me ellis at ellismowers.com or at ellismowers09 on Instagram and Facebook. And we'll have more of these product reviews on Fridays. I hope y'all are enjoying them. Uh, I know uh, some folks are buying them. Uh, so we'd really appreciate it. Super nice to get these products for free to be able to test and see how useful they are. This is one of the useful ones. Thank y'all again. I'll catch y'all in the next video. Take care.